good morning, bonjour from France. Well, good evening over there, good night, yeah? You might want to try this dessert. So today I'm going to make a dessert. It's very, very light. It's very, very simple. Um, it doesn't look so appetizing because it's white in colour, but trust me, it's very nice. And I will have my niece here, Melanie, yeah, who is going to help me out. She's actually a chef and she makes fantastic and uh, fantastic food and divine dishes. And so behind me, we have a little calf that was just born last night. It's not even 24 hours old. We're going to we're gonna start now. So what I'm going to do today is... Um, can hear some cows in the background, sorry. Okay, so I'm going to start with the TM6. I've got two machines today. This is the six, which all of you know. And this is the very first machine which I started off with, which is the five. Okay, which is the five. No, 31. Uh, 31, sorry, the 31. Yeah, so this is like 13 years old. This is 13 years old. Okay, so I'll start with one and I'll carry on with the other. This one aside. We're going to start with putting in the sugar. Oh no, this sugar. Okay, so I'm going to put in 100 grams of sugar. I'm going to switch to of course, of course, if you already have your own icing sugar, you don't need to do this. But of course, I'm just pulverizing the sugar and it comes out as smoke. As I'm sure most of you know now, you can have a look, right? All of you know this, we do this for the lemonade, right? Next, we are going to put some sucre vanille. This is vanilla sugar. So in France, we sell them in little packets. They sell them in little packets. In Singapore, you can find these in certain uh, like uh, baking shops. They do sell the vanilla sugar like this in a packet. One packet has got, let me see, eight grams over here. Otherwise, sometimes when I run out of this, you if you have vanilla pots, you can just put some vanilla pots. I just use normal sugar and I just add some vanilla essence or vanilla extract, whatever you want. You can go for that. Okay, après on va mettre um, la crème. La crème. Donc, on a besoin de son crème de crème. So, this is the cream that I'm going to use, right? This cream, we can find it in Singapore, Ellen Beer, right? J'ai bien prononcé, c'est Ellen Beer. Oui. Ellen, you know why I say this? Because my sister in law, who is sitting over there, <laughs> dit bonjour, Katia. Mm. Okay. My sister in law, who's sitting over there, this is her farm. Her cows contribute. The milk to this brand so i'm supporting her indirectly all the way from france or all the way from singapore i tried to buy this brand i know exactly what kind of milk goes into it i know how the cows are treated right so we have this one so we're going to measure this to 100 grams great i'm going to put the cream and i'm going to put this thing called fromage blanc i'll explain what fromage blanc it looks like this it looks like yogurt but it's not yogurt. So if you don't have this, they sell this in cold storage in Singapore. Um, if you can't find it at cold storage, you can, and it's about $5, I think for quite a lot. You can eat it like a yogurt, actually. People do it in desserts over here, just eat it plain. Otherwise you can use ricotta, yeah? Okay. Okay, up. C'est bon, les oeufs. We'll add in four eggs. Et la farine. And the flour. Okay, and then we're going to mix this 40 seconds at speed five. For those of you who know, we've got these uh, silicone molds. I brought, I brought this from Singapore. So these silicone molds, you can use to steam things. Otherwise, if you've got ramekins, you can use the ramekins as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take this out. I'm going to get my niece to rinse the bowl. You hear the cows. Oh, and my li the little uh, calf. Who is there? She's coming for a little walk. Let's come and say hi while my niece is rinsing the bowl. Comment ah, ah, I just asked my sister in law what she's going to call. Uh, it's a female cow. It's a female calf. I asked her what she's going to name her. She doesn't know yet. So, write in your names. What do you want her to name this calf? Okay. So, she needs to name this calf with, yeah, with the letter T. So please write in all your suggestions. She'll pick one of your names for her little calf, okay? Just born less than 24 hours ago. Uh, yeah, less than 24 hours ago, this calf was born. Not even, not even 15 hours ago, right? And it has to start with the letter T, okay? Letter T. So come on, give me all your suggestions so she can name this calf. Very, very cool, right? 
Very interesting, huh? So let me just cover this so that no flies come because we're in the country, we're in the countryside after all. Yeah. Okay. This is the TM31, which works like the TM6. Uh, this was the very first machine I started off with. Hence, it's got lots of buttons, more analog than digital. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to I'm going to steam these on this. I put 500 grams of water. Okay, I'm gonna cover this. And then all I need to do is put this one on top. Don't forget to give me the names of the cards, yeah? T, the letter T. Okay, and I'm gonna do this for 25 minutes. At Varoma, because I'm going to steam it. And we're going to go for speed one. So while this is being steamed, we're going to do a raspberry coolie over here, right? Do I have any names coming out? Do I have any names? Jan, give me some names. Come on, some of the names. Come on. One name. One name. Huh? Termi. 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 Parce que c'est tellement mix. Termi. Come on, give me some of the names. <laughs> Other name starts with the letter T, okay? Let's go for it. Right, okay. So now we're going to do this next. The raspberry coolie on this machine. Very nice. All the buttons like tap right to, 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 to press. Let me see. If, is it on? It's not on. I turn on the button here. See, it looks very different. The measuring, yep. Yeah, measuring cup is different. The lid is a little bit different. I need to unlock the lid here. They've got this green uh, silicone, which can be taken out to remove. But of course, you must always remember to put this one back. For six, we don't have to wear anything like that. Okay, for this one, all I need to do is put in 200 grams of raspberries. And we're going to put in 100 grams of sugar. sugar. Go. And citron, jus de citron. And 40 grams of lemon juice. That's it. Okay, and we're going to cook this for... So I need to, for the TM31, for the I need to lock Put the lid around. Okay, what I need to do is I need to lock the lid in like this. If I don't, if that there's a certain there's a certain catch, unlike the six. If you don't, because the sun doesn't have the arms to grab it, so if you don't get that catch, you're not going to be able to operate it. And I just need to cook this for eight minutes. Um, here we go. Eight minutes at ninety degrees. I press the button for ninety. And then I go to speed three. Yeah, have I got any more names? Oh, I've got some more names. Cool. What are the names? Tell me the names. Yeah. Trini. Trini. Tomase. Tomase. Oh, Tomase. We have Thermi, Trini, Tomase. Come on, give me one more name. One more name. One more name. Theodora. 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 Yeah. So we've got two things going on at the same time. So this thing, this fromage blanc, fromage blanc is a cheese, which is usually like for dessert. If you look it up in Google, you might get something like white cheese or cottage cheese or cream cheese or something like that. It is not, it does not have the consistency of cream cheese. It has, <clears throat> it's a little bit like yogurt, the consistency is yogurt. It is milk that is cold and then they ferment the milk. Like I say, if you cannot find, they sell this in uh, cold storage. If you can't find this in cold storage, just use ricotta because the recipe also comes for ricotta. Okay, so this is done. Let's, I can actually mix it and I can actually, let me stop this. Okay, so I can actually mix it and I can strain it because you know the seeds of the, the raspberry, but I don't like that. I think it's quite nice uh, on its own like this. Uh, there's one question. Yes. Which part of France are you enjoying your holiday? Which part in, of France? Am, which part of France am I in now? So as you can see, there is no Eiffel Tower. There is no. There are no tall buildings. There are no tall buildings here. Let me go into that because my my niece will plate up the dish afterwards, and then I will let her do it. But in the meantime, oh, there we go. So we are going to remove this and then we'll let her plate it. Should the nest fair? So which part of France am I at? Uh, well, I am in the, the countryside as always. Um, and if you're wondering if there's any shopping here, there's nothing. 
zero, zilch, nada, niet, mayo, tak ada, zero, zero shopping. The only thing we have here is a supermarket, that's all. Yeah? So she's going to remove it. It's in the west of France, right? Mm -hmm. I'm in the west of France. And, um, uh, and we are actually in the place called the Loire Valley, where there are many, many castles. It's actually where the, the, they're famous for castles. There are castles everywhere. Uh, we, the, the land here is very, it's not, there are no mountains. It's very undulating. So it's actually very nice for crops. Uh, okay, je vais laisser décorer. Ça va? Comme ça? Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Simple and pretty, right? Of course, we, she said, I can, you know, I can wipe it up nicely, but it's perfectly fine. Yeah. So that's pretty. So that's a mousse made with fromage blanc. Um, fromage blanc, like I said, it's kind of cheese, like a cheese, but you, you don't taste cheese at all. It's, you don't even, it's like a, just like a mousse, like a white mousse. It's definitely not chocolate, but it's not cheesy. It's a bit more custardy. You may taste more custardy. And um, yeah, and then you just make a, the raspberry coulis. This goes well with anything. Ice cream, cake, pavlovas, anything. You use your meringue and whip up a pavlova, and anything. But that's how it is. So pretty. Merci, mm. Melanie. Yeah. So I've got some names for the for the cast. We're going to remember the names again, and then I will see you all again next time. So bye bye from France. Au revoir. Yeah, bientôt.